Hi guys, I want to show you a little trick called Three Card Monty. It's used by gambling cheats all over the world to get money out of people. But I'm going to show you how it works. We've got the Ace of Hearts, the Three of Clubs and the Two of Spades. You've got to keep your eye on the Ace of Hearts, that's the money card, okay? What we'll do, we'll turn these over, we'll give them a little bit of a shuffle. This is what the gambler does, he gives them a bit of a mix up. To make it nice and fair for you, I'm going to keep on this camera the entire time now. And I'm going to turn these over and show you where the Ace is. It's in the middle, okay? What we'll do, we'll keep the ace in the middle, all right, and we'll deal these out on the table, okay? The gambler will then move two around like this, two around like this, and two around like this, and ask you whereabouts the ace is. So you'd obviously put your money on the one in the middle, okay? Unfortunately, that's why the gambler wins your money, because he turns it over to show you you're wrong. If you've gone for one on this side, that's the two of spades. If you've gone for one on this side, that's the ace of hearts, okay? That's all we're looking for. Okay, let's try that again. Let's we'll start again. Okay, so we've got the two of spades, the three of clubs, and the ace of hearts, all right? What the gambler does, he turns them over, he gives them a bit of a shuffle, so you can't keep track of where they are, okay? What I'll do, though, as a little bit of a help, I'll show you that the ace of hearts is in the middle. We're not going to cheat. I'll turn these over face down again and put them out on the table, just like this. I'm going to move these two around like that, these two around like that, and then these two around again. Where are you going to put your coin? A lot of people, if they've been watching, will go for the middle. Some people might go for the one over this side, okay? What that does, though, no one's ever going to go for this one where he's actually stuck the Ace of Hearts this time because over here we have the Three of Clubs and over here we have the Two of Spades. I'll show you one more time. One more time. We've got the Two of Spades, the Three of Clubs and the Ace of Hearts, all right? He turns them over, gives them a bit of a shuffle up, gives them a bit of a mix so you can't tell what's what, okay? Now I'll show you, I'll be nice and fair, I'm going to show you here but the Ace of Hearts is in the middle. To make it even more fair, to be even fairer, I'm going to take the Three of Clubs, okay, I'll take the Three of Clubs, and I'll place it over here on the table. Let's put the pound on the top of it just like this so no one can get to it, okay? Over here, we have the Ace of Hearts and the Two of Spades, all right? Ace is on the top, two is on the bottom. I'll turn these around like this, okay, and move them apart. Where do you think the Ace is? I'll give you a clue. Two's over here. You'd obviously say this one right here, but unfortunately for you, that's the three of clubs. The one over here, underneath the pound, where we weren't looking the entire time, is the ace of hearts. That's the three card Monty, and that's how they steal all of your money.